Welcome to another episode of Phil's Morning Drive Car Chat. Today, I'm in the second row. It's almost like being in my easy chair here of the car we're driving on the next episode of Phil's Morning Drive. I'm going to let you guess what it is. I will tell you that it's all new for 2018. Clearly, it has a third row. I'll let you guess, and then I'll tell you for sure at the end of this segment. The topic I wanted to discuss today has to do with the new for 2019 Chevrolet Camaro. Now, you may have seen some of the photos of that floating around on the internet, but I wanted to get into more specifics as far as the details associated with this new model because there's quite a few different things in addition to the different look. Now, you'll notice the front-end styling, uh, they're doing this as kind of a different thing, and I like this because it's a, there's a distinct difference now that you can tell a little bit easier at a glance between the LSLT versions, the RS and the SS. That front fascia, the grill, the LED headlamps, the different hood, there's just, the front end is gonna look a little bit different. And you'll notice that the Chevrolet bow tie moves around too. That's one of the things I brought up on my Facebook page whenever I asked people what they thought of the styling. Some people were commenting about how they didn't like the fact that that bow tie was down there on the, the grill or on that kind of weird section of the, the grill. Well, that's only on the SS version. If you look at like the 1LE version that you're seeing, there, there's just, it's it, it gets a little confusing to tell which is different. Now, me personally, of course, I'm going to want the SS because of the engine. But if you're looking at the different styling cues this way, I guess when you go to the Chevrolet lot or when you see one out and about, the 2019 version, it's going to be very, very easy to tell at a very quick glance which version that you're looking at. So that SS specific front fascia, they're calling that the flow tie, if you will, which is an open bow tie grill emblem. It's actually open. It has specific headlamps with the new LED signature, and it has a specific hood. So those are all SS specific. So that little section there in the middle that you're seeing here in the grill, that is specific to the SS. Really excited to get to drive this car. I don't have a lot of other performance numbers for you. I can tell you that the SS is now being offered with a 10-speed paddle shift automatic transmission uh, with a custom launch control feature associated with the automatic. So that's kind of exciting as well. So the 2019 Camaro, there's a few other cars that Chevrolet is doing for 2019, all new. The Cruze, the Malibu, and the Spark. I, for one, am the most excited about the Camaro. So I'm happy to share some of these photos with you and a little bit of this information. So... Really excited. Hopefully we'll get to drive a 2019 Camaro here on Phil's Morning Drive. By the way, if you want to see some thoughts on the other Camaro, go back and watch that 2017 Camaro SS video that we did. I'll put a link to that here in the description. Well, without further ado, let's take a look now. The car that we're driving this week on the show is new for 2018. You can tell it's got three rows here based on the seating and how we're shooting this part of the episode. The car we're driving is a 2018 Ford Expedition. This is the Expedition Max, so it's a foot longer than the standard model. It's what used to be like the XL or the long wheelbase version or what have you. But it's got a lot of space in it, lots of cargo space, plenty of towing capacity, all new features throughout, a lot more space than the old one, and a little bit of a different ride. We'll get some more in-depth with that episode that'll be out here coming up in the next few days, so we hope that you'll check that out. In the meantime, thanks for watching this edition of Phil's Morning Drive Car Chat. We'll see you next time.